The text spoken by the voices and the sound volume are exactly the same as in the original recording. To help the air adapt itself to the strange rhythm, rapidity and softness of the voice entity's speech, each utterance is repeated several times. The voices here selected are grouped according to the persons addressed and their respective answers, followed by a translation and explanation. They are examples chosen to give the reader a breakthrough, an acoustic illustration of the material presented in the book. The listener is asked to read any text spoken in languages he does not know with particular attention so that he may be able to grasp each separate word phonetically. Please note the commentary that goes with each voice text as the meaning of some utterances can only be understood in context with the situation that gave rise to them. The first voice is that of Margarete Petrowski who had told the experimenter during her lifetime that she did not believe in an existence after death. After her passing, the experimenter asked her how she felt in the beyond, and a voice, identified as coming from Margarete, answered, Bedenke, ich bin. German, imagine, I am. Again we hear Margarete Petrowski's voice this time calling her former employer, Dr. Zenta Maurina. Zenta.
it's very dangerous, but um, it's crazy. Like when someone showed me the roof and the, and the scaffolding poles and the antennas and climbing the lift shaft and da 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 da.
ta đã về với ông ấy Tôi đã về với mình đây Nhưng tôi còn đâu mấy ngày nữa Tôi đã chết rồi má con đây ở Tôi chết không thôi Tôi không thôi Tôi không thôi Các bạn của tôi nói Tôi phải về Để nói cho các bạn biết rằng Tôi đã chết
Yeah.